Hello, lovely people. So, the black farmer have sent me out some things to try. Let's have a look. They don't just do sausages. Well, these kind of sausages. But they also do cured meat. All know what goes amazingly well with cured meat, which is pickles. So, I've got these amazing large capers. I've got some pickled onions, gherkins, red onion chutney, mustard, some nice ripe brie, cheddar, some Normandy butter, some sourdough, and some sauerkraut. First up, we have smoked slow and garlic wild venison. It's actually quite mild in flavour. Black peppercorns, you can even see them going through the salami. Uh, it's got a nice meaty, venison, gamey taste. Nice fat content and a really nice texture, quite smooth. So I'm going to try this with a little bit of brie. Tiny amount of pickled onion. The gaminess holds its own with this combination and this works really, really well. Dorset chorizo picante. Instantly you're getting hit with that paprika. I'm excited to try this one. Lovely marbling, great fat content. This is everything you want from a chorizo. It's smoky, slightly sweet, and it's got a lovely spice that comes in afterwards. Nothing too strong, but definitely welcomed. I'm gonna try it with a little bit of caper. Just that rising acidity, just mellows out any of the fat and the spiciness. I think the gherkin will work well as well. And we have the white pepper and fennel salami. You can smell the fennel. Look at that. This is 10 out of 10. I knew I'd save this one for last. That fennel just makes everything so fragrant. It adds like an element of freshness to it, even though it's cured. This one can hold up against anything, so I'm going straight in with the brie. Dude, you have created three sensational cured meat products. I have to admit, the fennel one gets my vote. This by far is the best, um, followed by the chorizo, followed by the wild garlic. Definitely buy these again, and uh, thank you so much for sending them out.